Oh, God, that's terrifying. Oh, my God. And it's so happy. <laughs> oh, just, oh, um, oh, I'm nightmares about that. Right, we're on our way to Arafu <laughs> to deliver a message for Lucy West. And we're getting our ass beaten by the wildlife rather than people with guns. And something just, uh, Seems wrong about. Okay, my game is being weird. Yes, I'm still haunted by that. Bloody. That's a vicious dog. Let's leave it alone if we can. I don't feel right going around killing. I mean, yes, it's a vicious dog. But, you know. Hey! Here I am sticking up for... I can't aim for shit. Here I was sticking up for dogs. And you just go and do that. Oh, God. I feel even worse now. I just have to shoot a dog and his partner. What next? Are you going to tell me they had pups in that house? Make me feel even worse. I wish you guys were quieter. Every time I hear you, I think I've got a giant scorpion behind me. It's not. So... Hello. A town? Fairly fortified town by the looks of it. Oh, I've got to go all the way around just to get in. Harm. I'm a simple traveler. Right. What do you want? Do you harass everyone? Well, you can never be too careful. Be warned, it's not safe here. Super mutants attacked recently and oh. carried off some of our friends. What the Come hell's in. a super mutant? Don't cause any trouble, okay? I'm not going to. I just wanted to see what was going on. Big trouble in Bit Town. Hmm. Hello there, Kimba. Welcome to Big Town. Not that there's much of a town left. Those super mutants keep kidnapping people. Uh, what do you know about these super mutants? I thought growing up was a good thing. You got to leave and explore the real world. Well, nobody tells you that the real world sucks. I could have told At you first, that. we just paid the slavers to leave us alone. When we ran out of money, Red found other ways to convince them to leave us alone. But now she and the others are gone. Super mutants attacked and carried them off. No one knows when they're coming back, or who will be next. Uh, slow down. It'll be okay," he says heroically. "Do you know where they took them? They took them to the north, to the police station, or something. Do you think you could find them and rescue them? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, that's wonderful. Thank you so much. We don't have much, but if you can bring them back alive, we'll give you everything we can. What weapon have you got? Uh, yeah, do you know where they took your friends? Oh, they're somewhere to the northeast. In a police station or something. Thanks for rescuing our friends. Don't thank me till I've actually rescued them. Uh, why do they keep attacking the town? Whenever those... things come, they grab a few people instead of killing them. No one knows what happens after that. No one wants to know. There's... 
There's always so much blood after they come, and then someone has to move the bodies. Mm. Where did you people come from? Oh, Little Lamplight is where most of us came from. Red and Pappy and Flash and Bittercup. We used to play together when we were kids. Then we got old and we had to leave. Those were the rules. So we packed up and headed here, like we were supposed to. No one told us it would be like this. We never have fun anymore. And most of us... Most of us are dead. Hmm. Alright then. I'm so tired of being frightened all the time. That cow's pulling a very weird face. Yeah, what? Seriously, I want to know. Those assholes in lamplight said that this place was great. Is it a BB gun? I don't know. I'm always tempted to shoot it just to find out. I'm bloody curious now. Alright, so at some point we'll get on and rescue their friends. I'm sure they're fine. We need to find out what the hell a super mutant is. What direction am I going? That way. A big green man. I think I just found out what a super mutant is. And he's got an even bigger, greener friend in the background. Super mutant. Come on. Headshot! You may be big and you may be green, but your skull don't stop bullets. Are you? I know you had a friend who's wandered off. I'm not seeing anymore. Oh wait, there I am. I'm surprised he can fit in the back of there. Oh, you have a very big gun. There's your friend. Oh, I missed. Oh, no, I crippled him and it didn't do a lot. Oh, my God. Oh, you are ugly. Oh, my bullets. Okay. Don't try and take these things on. Cl oh my god. Do you know what you remind me of? The floating skull over there. Oh. I mean, good loot. Oh, tin cans are actually useful. M249 machine gun. I'm over encumbered. Surprise, surprise. Okay. Oh, bandana. Let's put that on. Repair my hunting rifle. Ah, oh, 
Screw it, why not? Let's have a look at this then. Ooh. No iron sights, unfortunately. But, uh... It's kind of cool. Very cool, in fact. Keep hold of that. It's not going to do me any good right now, though. What am I after? Oh, my vault suit. At least I've got a few more bullets for this now, though. The bandana's looking good. I like the bandana. Oh, you had a hunting rifle. See, I could have saved that tin can. Yep, I could have saved the tin can. Oh, God damn it. Fine. Moonbeam Outdoor Cinema. And loot. Ooh, cheeky little bugger. Well, I'm not wasting bullets on you. You're a fly, for God's sake. Ow! Ooh! Oh, you do quite a bit of damage with them things. Oh, God, I'm going to get myself killed. I'm telling you, the wildlife! Bloody dangerous! Now wait for the sarcastic comment from someone on YouTube saying, Well, there is a wasteland. What did you expect? Couple of raiders playing baseball, apparently. He's gone to second. He's going to third. And it's a home run. But your friend don't really seem to care. <laughs> Keep running, lad. You know. Very tempted to just leave them at it. Although I could sell that armor. I don't think I'm going to get past them. Where am I going? That direction. There's a vicious dog over there. And if I attack the vicious dog, which is going to attack me, they're going to hear the gunfire. Hmm. See if we can get by. Although I shouldn't really leave raiders running around, but I don't know how long he'll go running around the four bases. the rock. I was just admiring the view there. It looked quite nice. Alright, I think I got past everything. So... What is with my load distance? It seems to be really small. I'm going to assume, though, this is our trader. Damn it! Thought I got past you. <sighs> oh! What the? Guys with laser guns? the hell are you fighting? Oh, boy. Who that? You're not involved with this. You want to keep it that way. Oh. To see you. you threaten me, then tell me it's good to see me. Brotherhood Outcast. Yeah, let's not... Yeah, you are. It's a good idea. Let's not piss off the guys in big metal armor with a robot. Right, traitor!
Hello there. Welcome, welcome. My name is Crow, and I travel the land offering vestments of protection. And you are fortunate I found you in time. You bear the look of one who is haunted. But I am proud to say that my wares can protect you from even the cruel claws of death itself. Have a look. I think you've got some written rude on the back of your head, mate, because your caravan guards are staring at you very intently. Uh, I'm, I'm not here to buy, man, I'm here to sell. And here are the means to remake yourself. That was crap, let's get rid of it. Did absolutely nothing to that bloody super mutant. Oh, really? Oh, do you have anything remotely useful? It. No. Okay. I'll keep the weapons then. A pleasure doing business. You really need more caps. Right. We have made it. We are at Arafu and relatively in one piece bandana does look good right god being the bloody postman sucks hello there whoa jesus hang on you're not one of them i nearly blasted you in two get over here before they spot you do you mind Trying to deliver the mail and you're trying to blow me up. Now what the hell are you doing all the way out here? I have a letter for the West family. That's great, but I got bigger problems than being the town post office right now. The shit's about to hit the fan in this cesspool, and I don't think I can stop them. Uh, what, raiders or slavers? No way. If they were, you'd be staring at a burned out ghost town. Well, then the think on the bright side, it could be worse. Punks. Well, at first, they do typical gang bullshit. You know, break stuff and make lots of noise. But they always kept their distance. But this last time, they went too far. They killed all of our Brahmin. I mean, that's our lifeblood out here, you know? Uh, so what's got you spooked? Nothing. The family are just a bunch of damn punks. Alright. You ever take one out? Are you out of your mind? I drop one of them, and the rest will use me as a bullet catcher. So just shoot as them all. As soon as they roll into town, I lock my doors just like everyone else. We could really use some assistance here. Ah, uh, all right. What do you need? I don't want to take my eyes off the ramp here. There's no telling when the family will return. Can you do me a favor and check on the other people's houses here? You know, make sure they're doing okay. Speak with Davis West, Karen Shenzi, and Ken Ewers. Uh, all right then, I'll go do that. Just watch yourself. I've got an itchy trigger finger. Have you now? <clears throat> so have I. Don't be so damn rude. I just offered to help. Bellend. All right. Knock on the door. Hello. Is this the mailman? Oh, I do hope my fall catalog has arrived. What? Uh, okay. Oh, Evan, he's such a gentleman. No, he's not. He's an asshole. Please, do come inside. Let me unlock the door for you. What a weird woman. What the Whoa. hell are you doing in here? Get the fuck out. Uh, yeah, your wife let me in. Oh, for the love of... Look, she's dumber than a bag of hammers, okay? If you want to talk to anyone, you need to talk to oh, me. a nice thing to say about so your what wife. what the fuck do you want? I want you to stop fucking swearing at me. <laughs> Is everything okay? We're great. Just peachy. 
I love sitting in my house with my thumb up my ass. What you do in Tell your own time is your own business. All day isn't going to make us any safer. We need to take action. Yeah, well, that's what I intend to do. Good. Now get out. You offer to help people, and they say about shooting you because they have an itchy trigger finger. And you get a guy with an attitude like that. God, why should I even bother helping you? At least Megaton was nice. Shenzi. Yes. Who is it? Uh, Evan King sent me. Oh, he did. Well, it's about damn time he did something. Come on in. I'll unlock the door. Well, so far, I'm bloody much nicer. It's nice to see a friendly new. Oh, thank God for that! Someone nice is in this time. town. The name's Karen Shenzi. Oh, is everything okay? Scared out of my mind. I'm glad he's checking on us, but until someone nips the problem in the bud, we may as well stay inside forever. Uh, what's your take on Evan? Because I think he's a bell end. He's a spineless wimp. That too. His best solution to the family is to stay inside our homes and hide. What does that tell them? It tells them that we can be pushed around whenever they want. I'm sick of it. And I'm sick of King. Alright, even more reason for me to sort it out, because King's useless. Uh, can you tell me more what's been going on? We're scared shitless. Evan King's got everyone so worked up about the family, no one wants to set foot outside. That asshole runs the show. But does he really do anything about our problem? No. That didn't really tell me more about what's going on. You just moaned about... Okay, never mind. What do you think of the family? All they do is terrorize us. They taunt us to open our doors, throw bottles at our houses, and scream at us. If I knew King had my back, I'd step outside and show them just how I feel about their visits. Especially after this last attack. Fair enough, well... That... I have to go. Sure. Go. Just like everyone else. No, now you now you're giving me attitude. You are becoming the one reason why I should help. <sighs> Alright, maybe the West family would be nicer. Oh, they ain't locked the door. Oh. Okay. So that's why the door's not locked. Dude, Lucy is not going to be happy. The bodies of the West have bite marks on the net that go to the bone. They've been dead for a little while as well. Hmm. Shit. Alright, two out of three, I guess. Is everyone okay? Yeah. What did they tell you? Everyone okay? The West are dead. The family must have gotten to them in the last attack. Sons of bitches. Damn it! If only we had more men, we could stand up to them. I'm sick of them terrorizing this town. Wait a minute. When you searched the West's place, did you find their son Ian's body? No, just the father and the mother. This has to be the work of the family. I've caught that weirdo leader of theirs talking to Ian down by the river. Look, I know I've asked a lot of you already, but you have to find that kid. He deserves better than all this. Alright, so the family have got Ian. Alright, I'll figure out what happened. Thanks, kid. You're alright. Uh, yeah, the West had bite marks. Does that mean anything to you? Bite marks on their necks? That's the strangest thing I've ever heard. The family must have attack dogs with them or something. Oh, this is all I needed right now. What am I going to do? They'll keep coming back until all of us are dead. Uh, yeah, what can I... Where do you think I could find them? I need some sort of hint. I think they live somewhere east or northeast of here. Problem is, they always travel in the dark, so I can't see exactly where they go. There's all kinds of places they could be hiding, like Hamilton's Hideaway, the old Moonbeam Cinema, or Northwest Seneca Metro Station. Right, I'll have to check them out. I've already been to the cinema, so they're not there. Next time I see the family, 
There's gonna be hell to pay. Sure there is. You're not going to go carrying your house at all. Right. Blood ties, locate the family. Moonbeam Cinema, Hamilton's Hideaway, Northwest Seneca Station. Just where's more light? Alright, so there's the station. Which seems a bit more logical. Alright, according to my map. Hamilton's Highway just over there. Which does not look like some sort of gang hideout. Or at least if there was. No, that's a scavenger. Mm, doesn't seem a place for a gang to go. They're not at the cinema. But hiding out in a metro station? And they can sneak along underneath the bridge and just come around the side. If, I mean, if they're coming from those two directions, you'd see them. See? Logic! Maybe you should try using that next time someone walks into town and you decide to try and blow them up. Think about it! If they're wearing a bright blue jumpsuit with yellow numbers saying 101, probably not part of the family. Moron. 